Welcome, my Sagittarius friends. This is Jennifer from Mystic Star Tarot. I want to thank you for joining me on my first round of readings for the Zodiac. This is a general reading for those born under the Sagittarius Zodiac sign, or for those who want to support or know more about where the Sagittarius is going. This reading is going to be about the abundance that summer solstice is going to bring us. As the summer solstice is the longest day of the year in the Northern Hemisphere, we have a lot of ability to get things done. So this reading is about giving you guidance and support on trying to get all that you need to get done finished on this amazing day. The deck I'll be using for this reading is the Witch's Tarot created by Ellen Dugan and Mark Evans. It's a beautiful deck. I love it. it my clients request it um, far beyond any other deck I have and I read from. So I'll be doing a three card spread with this deck and to finish off the reading I will be doing a, a bit of a blessing from this angel inspiration deck. It is a beautiful oracle deck that Kim Dreyer has created. I like finishing off a tarot reading with an oracle blessing as oracle cards are usually all about light and love where tarot cards can get into the shadows and sometimes it's harder. So, what I'd like to do is start off. Let's see what the cards have to say for Sagittarius in their abundance reading. I apologize for the lawnmower if you can hear it. My neighbor decided to mow their lawn right now. So, All right, so our first card, the Four of Pentacles. The Four is all about stability, whereas Pentacles is about growth and abundance. Pentacle is great to have right now. It's um, a fantastic card. It does heed some warning, which we will get into, but it's a fantastic card to see. It gives us a direction. Our second card, ooh, well, he's always exciting to see, death. He's going to give us more of a direction than the Four of Pentacles. It's going to add on to that. The death is a major arcana card for change. It is the death of the ego rather than a person that he talks about. Well, Sagittarius, you are a fire sign, and the death is definitely a fire sign. We're going to end off on a bit of a water sign. The Two of Cups. Two is about duality and choice, whereas cups are about emotion and intuition. So it kind of heat or will uh, douse down some of the fire from the, the death that we saw. All right, let's weave these three cards together, shall we? When we're talking about abundance, pentacles are always fantastic to get because that's what they stand for is abundance and growth. This is true of the four of pentacles. The four of pentacles brings stability into that growth. This man here who's so protecting his wealth, he's got it tightly secured has caused himself some problems. He's created structures that he doesn't need and are not helpful. If you see, he's got two pentacles on under his feet. Pentacles are an earth sign. He has now taken and put a barrier in between him and his power element. He is an ungrounded individual. He may have some money, but he doesn't have that stability he needs in the ground. He's ungrounded. His body is unable to flow properly. His energies are not flowing. He has blocked his root chakra, which again is about grounding. He's also covered his solar plexus and his heart. Solar plexus is for will and strength. Your heart, well, is for your heart. These chakras are very important. You can't just shut them off. You can't isolate yourself from the world and expect to have abundance. You may have some material wealth, However, it's not going to grow well. You need connection and flow of your chakras to allow that energy to create and manifest your, your dreams and wills. Which leads us into the death card. Death is part of this structure, this ego that you've, that's created this little box. Ego loves this little box that you stay in. It's safe. Death is asking you to take down these built-up structures 
this protection that you have embraced yourself with, it needs to come down. Once you have been able to kind of light fire, if you will, to this structure, that is when the true prosperity will grow. Right? There's lots of abundance, lots of water. Water is connected to your intuition and your creativity. Both of these are going to be integral in you acquiring and manifesting your abundance. This union, it's a union of you, you with your higher self. Getting out of your ego box that has been created here and allowing yourself to connect instead of with the lower vibrational ego, with the higher vibrational higher self or intuition. When you unite with that, that is when your abundance is going to grow and grow well, and you're going to be very prosperous from it. I hope that made sense, and I hope that you find guidance in that. Let's see what the angels want to add to this. All right, my Sagittarius friends, what input do my angels have for you? <laughs> be free. Sometimes I love it when the cards just reinforce what I just said. Be free. Get out of your box. Allow it to die and allow this to grow. The universe has many gifts and many journeys and paths for you. You need to let go of this structure and your ego your ego is going to only cause stagnation, whereas your intuition and higher self will cause freedom, abundance, and miracles. I want to thank you for watching my video. I hope you found that helpful and gave you some direction. I will be creating more videos for the zodiac signs in the upcoming months. So if you have any comments, suggestions on what and where you'd like this to go, please leave it in the comment box below. I am always open for more feedback. Also, if you like the video, please remember to give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for the latest content, as I don't drop videos on a regular day. It is in correspondence to events and the calendar. Also, if you like my video and want to support me in making more, I have a Patreon page with many tiers and lots of perks. I've provided a helpful link below. One of the perks that the Patreons have is that I do the same type of spread for them, but I go more in depth into it for them. So please do go and check that out. And I want to thank you again for watching my video. Until tomorrow, my friends.